my Beacon Town Eagles. Welcome to Miss Woodward Reads. Today I'm reading a book that reminds me of the 12 days of Christmas, but it is The 13 Nights of Halloween, written and illustrated by Guy Vasilovich. Hmm, 13 Nights of Halloween. Ooh, a witch in a full moon. That's super spooky. <gasps> Haunted houses. On the first night of Halloween, my mummy gave to me a bright, shiny skeleton key. On the second night of Halloween, my mummy gave to me a two-headed snake and a bright, shiny skeleton key. On the third night of Halloween, my mummy gave to me three baseball bats. A two-headed snake and a bright, shiny skeleton key. Are they really baseball bats? No, they're bats that play baseball. So silly. On the fourth night of Halloween, my mummy gave to me four icky eyeballs, three baseball bats, a two-headed snake, and a bright, shiny skeleton key. Look, they're all following her. On the fifth night of Halloween, my mummy gave to me five singing skulls. Would you want that for Halloween? Maybe you would. Four icky eyeballs, three baseball bats, a two-headed snake, and a bright, shiny skeleton key. Where are they going? It looks like they're going to a very spooky house. On the sixth night of Halloween, my mummy gave to me six corpses caroling, five singing skulls, four icky eyeballs, three baseball bats, a two-headed snake, and a bright, shiny skeleton key. Do you see how it sounds like the 12 days of Christmas? On the seventh night of Halloween, my mummy gave to me seven goblins gobbling, six corpses caroling, five singing skulls, four icky eyeballs, three baseball bats, a two-headed snake, and a bright, shiny skeleton key. <gasps> Ooh, yeek. On the eighth night of Halloween, my mummy gave to me eight marching mutants. Ooh, they look like zombies. Seven goblins gobbling, six corpses caroling, five singing skulls, four icky eyeballs, three baseball bats, a two-headed snake, and a bright, shiny skeleton key. <gasps> Ooh, that looks spooky. On the ninth night of Halloween, my mommy gave to me nine werewolves waiting, eight marching mutants, seven goblins gobbling, six corpses caroling, five singing skulls, four icky eyeballs, three baseball bats, two-headed snake, and a bright, shiny skeleton key. Ooh, my goodness. She has a lot of spooky things. Ooh, what's next? What is next? On the 10th night of Halloween, my mummy gave to me 10 demons dancing, nine werewolves waiting, eight marching mutants, seven goblins gobbling, six corpses caroling, five singing skulls, four icky eyeballs, three baseball bats, and a two-headed snake, and a bright shiny skeleton key. Miss Woodward never said singing was her strong point, so. I'm trying my best. <gasps> Ooh, I love witches. On the 11th night of Halloween, my mummy gave to me 11 witches witching, 10 demons dancing, nine werewolves waiting, eight marching mutants, seven goblins gobbling, six corpses caroling, <gasps> Five singing skeletons, four icky eyeballs, three baseball bats, a two-headed snake, and a bright, shiny skeleton key. Ooh. What are those? On the twelfth night of Halloween, my mommy gave to me twelve ghosts a-ghosting. Eleven witches witching, ten demons dancing, nine werewolves waiting, eight marching mutants, seven goblins gobbling, six corpses caroling, five singing skulls, 
four, icky eyeballs, three, baseball bats, a two-headed snake, and a bright, shiny skeleton key. What do you think she'll get on the last night? <gasps> Ooh, what are those? Vampires? On the 13th night of Halloween, my mummy gave to me. I like how they wrote this in a circle. 13 thirsty vampires, 12 ghosts a ghosting, 11 witches, witches witching, 10 demons dancing, 9 werewolves waiting, 8 marching mutants, 7 goblins gobbling, 6 corpses caroling, 5 singing skulls, 4 icky eyeballs, 3 baseball bats, a two-headed snake. What's the last thing? And a bright, shiny skeleton key. What did the key unlock? It looks like a monster party with all the things she was given for the 13 nights of Halloween. The end. And there she is with her skeleton key. I like this book. It reminds me of the 12 days of Christmas and I can kind of sing with it too. I'm really good at it. Or if I'm not, like Miss Woodward, but that's okay. Bye, my Beacon Town Eagles.